In order to have better sex, you need to get in your sensory brain. Here is an example of how to do that. Grab anything, anything you can touch, and I want you to touch it. So if you're getting in your sensory brain, you are trying to notice the nerve endings that are firing as you touch the surface of the object. Not just the nerve endings, but notice what's hot, what's cool, what feels soft, what feels more rough, what feels firm, what feels soft and light. That's getting into your sensory body. One way to test, actually, if you are in your sensory body very fully is to keep touching this, lift your hand, and see if you can still feel your nerve endings fire underneath where they were just touching. Should feel kind of like a tingling, or you may even still feel if it was cool, the cool sensation. If it's warm, the warm sensation. That's called getting in your sensory body. In order to have good sex, you need to have access to your sensory body. We live in a world where we are so cognitive and overthinking everything. You're busy working, you're busy thinking about this, plotting this, solving this problem. But all of that stuff takes you out of your sensory body. Actually, to the point that some people are so like out of that sensory body that like by the end of the day, it's like you shut down and you've actually lost touch with your sensory body. So why would this help with your sex life? Sex is about your senses. It's about getting lost in that sensory body when somebody touches or kisses you, feeling the nerve endings as they fire and, and feeling and noticing as blood rushes through different parts of your body. For example, if somebody kisses you on your cheek, noticing even beyond the cheek, where else do I feel that in my body? Do I feel it back in my neck? Do I feel warmth in my cheeks? Do I feel warmth in my chest? Your, the, your sensory body is, is firing all the time. And if you are not accessing your sensory body when you're having sex, then you're missing out on a world of sexual excitement. So practice this. You can practice this in multiple ways. It can look like as you're sitting here, like practicing, okay, touching this sensation and noticing, oh, how do my nerve endings fire? When somebody does kiss you, notice where you feel it in the rest of your body. Um, when you're exercising, noticing how you feel your sensations when you do this activity versus this activity. But practice getting in your sensory body for better sex. This is Angela Scar2, and please like and subscribe. Also, if you would like to see me as a client, please submit a contact form at therapistinstlouis.com.